In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate age in Google Sheets using someone's date of birth. So the way that we're going to do this is using this date difference function. Um, so this function has three parameters, start date, end date, and unit. So there are a number of units um, that are accepted in this function. The ones that we want to use are Y, which is years, um, YM, which takes the number of whole months after subtracting years, and then um, MD, which takes the number of days after subtracting whole months. So there are a few other accepted values in this function. I'm not really going to cover those here, but I will place a link to the blog post um, where I go over this in more detail in the description of the video. So if you want to learn um, the other ways to use the function, um, you can click on that. But these are the three that we will be using. Um, so to use this function to calculate the age in years, you can see in this example I have date of birth and I have today's date. So I'm just going to set up the function date diff, um, my start date, end date, and then um, for the years, I want to do that Y in quotation marks and then uh, my closing parentheses. And you can see that calculates age. So I will copy that formula down. And now I have the age and years for all of these different birth dates uh, with today's date. So then the next one we're going to do is month, which is YM is my unit. So we're going to do date difference, birth date, today's date, and then in quotation marks, YM, and that's going to give us the months, and then the last one is days. So you can see um, with this function, I'm able to calculate years, months, and days individually. But now, um, if you want to, in one formula, calculate um, years, months, and days, there's not a single function you can do. You actually have to nest together um, this function three times the way we have here. So I'll show you how to do that. Um, this will end up being your formula. You're basically nesting together these date difference functions using and. And then I also put in um, some text labels here for years, months, and days. But basically, you just nest together the same function we just went over three times um, using the and symbol. So I will just show you how to do that. So date difference, I'm going to do this, this, and then my first one is years. Then I'm going to put an and, and then I also want to add on a label for that. So I'm going to add on this text string here. Um, so if I just calculate that, you can see that at does the years and it adds that um, years label on it. That's what this and does. Um, but then I want to also do my other age calculations. So I'm going to do that. get the months in there months and the days months, days and days then I'll copy the formula down. So this calculated years, months, and days in one function by nesting together the three ones that we went over earlier. So that's pretty much it for this video. Again, if you want to go over this in further detail, um, just click the link to the blog post that I'll paste in the description of this video. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.